Rebecca Alcock, CEO and founder of Beachy Girl Incorporated, not your average nonprofit organization. Also, one of our initiatives is called Naughty Girl, K-N-O-T-T-Y, and it celebrates the beauty, the transition, the flexibility of our natural hair. It's not that we're against anybody that does not have natural hair, but we want to celebrate what is naturally ours. Today, I'm here in beautiful New Orleans, Louisiana, and I'm here to celebrate with my homegirl, Kendra Joy. She's partnering with me, Beachy Girl Incorporated, to bring about awareness about some things that are going on across our country that a lot of people don't realize. There are some little girls inside of public schools who are being bullied and harassed by their teachers and their peers, um, and they don't even realize they're harassing these little girls. They feel that if they come to school with an afro or afro puffs, or if their hair is braided a different kind of way that it's um, distracting or offensive. And so imagine being six, seven, eight years old and a person that you look up to, such as your teacher, or someone who you look up to as your friend, tells you that your hair is not that great. Um, kind of messes with your self-esteem. So we're here to bring awareness. Who is not from New Orleans in the house? All right, tell me where y'all from. Charleston. Charleston. Wait, Charleston is represented. Oh, Charleston. 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 Oh, Charleston
Thank you. 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 Thank you.